Well, driverless taxis soon going to be coming to Charm City. Waymo cars now on the roads in Baltimore City for manual testing, but soon will be fully autonomous. These cars, as you can imagine, getting some mixed reviews in our area. And WJZ is live at 7 o'clock tonight. Tara Lynch on your corner in downtown Baltimore. And Tara, you break down what we need to know with this. Some people concerned about safety, and rightfully so. Yeah, Rick, I mean, I have never been in a driverless vehicle before. I don't know about you, but a lot of people are very concerned about safety. Will these cars recognize road closures? Will they recognize the local traffic patterns, how people drive in this area? Those are some of the questions on the minds of Baltimore residents that I spoke with uh, to this evening. Waymo is already here on the ground in Baltimore for manual testing, meaning that there is a driver behind the wheel right now so that the vehicle can learn the roadway here. Uh, in fact, I even saw one over the weekend just up the street uh, from where I'm standing here on President Street and Fayette. Waymo cars are already available in five cities nationwide. The latest expansion includes almost two dozen cities, including Baltimore. Waymo says the vehicles will roll out in phases. If you see a car in Baltimore City right now, again, there's a driver behind the wheel. The vehicle is getting used to the area. Phase two includes autonomous driving with a specialist behind the wheel before moving to fully autonomous driving. MDOT says companies interested in testing highly autonomous vehicles need to apply for a permit to operate in the state. Dana Seish says she's been in a Waymo before while visiting San Francisco and says she believes the cars are safe. It felt very like um, passive almost like when it's on the road and another car starts going, it's going to let the other car go. Um, so very safe eh, to each his own. We'll see what happens. I'm going to stick to driving my regular car and they can they can be like the Jetsons if they want to and, and they could be the ones to test the first flying car too. Yeah, straight out of a cartoon, it seems. I did speak with officials from Waymo this evening, and they tell me that uh, these driverless cars, again, will be on our roads right now for that testing period. They don't yet know when the fully autonomous uh, service will be available here. That all depends on the safety of the testing that happens right now. And again, Waymo rolling out to many cities nationwide, including neighboring Washington, D.C. and Philadelphia. For now, reporting live on your corner in downtown Baltimore, Tara Lynch, WJZ. It is certainly interesting. I have not heard in one either. Tara, thank you. Let's.